Hi, my name is Amanda Stone and I am the 124th Fighter Wing Sexual Assault Response Coordinator, or SARC, and this is your 124th and 124. Start the timer. Did you know that April is Sexual Assault Awareness and Prevention Month? If you are looking to get involved and set forth as an ally for sexual assault and violence prevention, there are a few great opportunities coming up in the month of April. Join the Sapper Office in participating in the Virtual 5K. From April 1st to 25th, you can walk, run, bike, jump, or skip 5K. Take a selfie and post it to the IDNG Service Member and Family Support Facebook page to receive a swag bag and a t-shirt. The Sapper Office is also sponsoring a hygiene item drive through the month of April, with all items collected being donated to local sexual assault and domestic or interpersonal violence crisis centers. Any unopened and unused hygiene items, such as toothpaste, body wash, shampoo, and conditioner, can be dropped off at designated bins in the Billeting Main Office, Settler Market, Gowan Field Activity Center, and Base Gym. If you or someone you know needs assistance regarding a sexual assault, our office can be contacted via phone at 208-954-3369, 24 hours per day, seven days per week. And now for the news. An injured great horned owl was found near Building 415 on March 3rd. The federally protected bird was captured by members of the 124th CES and transported to a rescue center for rehabilitation. F-35B Lightning IIs with U.S. Marine Corps Marine Operational Test and Evaluation Squadron 1 from Marine Corps Air Station Yuma, Arizona arrived March 12th to train with pilots from the 190th Fighter Squadron. Overdrill Weekend Fuel Specialists with the 124th LRS performed hot pit refueling operations, which is when aircraft run while receiving fuel loads. F-35B Lightning IIs with Marine Fighter Attack Training Squadron 501 from Marine Corps Air Station Beaufort, South Carolina, dropped inert GBU-12 bombs at the OCTC on March 23rd. U.S. Congressman Mike Simpson visited Gowan Field March 25th for the groundbreaking ceremony of the 124th Med Group's new medical training facility. Do you have a story you would like featured? Contact Public Affairs to be featured in an upcoming edition of the 124th and 124th.